Hello YouTube, um, today we're going to be, well I'm going to be just showing you Extra Biomes mod for 1.1, um, it's pretty cool, it just gives you like Green Hills for instance, this is on single player, uh, that's the Green Hills map, there's 16 different like biomes, so plenty of biomes, that's the Green Hills, then there's Jungle, and these just two, but there are a lot more, like thick growth there. That's pretty cool. Um, I like the green hills because it just cheers me up and everything. Right. So, um, so what you do to get this is go on your web browser and type in. Well, there'll be a link for this in the description. Then download from Minecraft 1.1. 1 .1. Um, I'll just do it again to show you guys. Add fly and just wait for that. Oh, look a lion. Yeah, anyway, right, so skip add and then just downloads it for you. Or not. Right, just click download. And then it should come up just there. Now, what you want to do is just open this. Um, this is for Windows, by the way, if you're wondering. Um, I'm not sure how to do it on Mac, but yeah. Now, in your search bar, just type percent app data percent. Um, dot minecraft bin and minecraft well your minecraft dot jar whatever you call it um now just go on extra biomes this one just double click on that and then go on classes and then you have all these now just open them both to the side like that um and then just get all of these highlight them all and just drag them over into there I'm not going to do it again because I've done it and it might mess it up or something but yeah now once you've done that just run your minecraft and it should work um, yeah that's basically how you do it um, if you want if you've got a server and you want it like different you want the maps the same maps for you um, quite a cool way to do this is just right create new world I'll just try and get a quick biome for you um, to generate this yeah, god it takes a long time right when your minecraft finally loaded uh, yep this is autumn forest I think yeah uh, if you want this, obviously for a multiplayer server it won't be the same. It won't have like all the colours because that's unique to the mod. Um, people on your server can get the mod and then it will look like this. But if you want the, just the general map and all the hills and the cool floating bit up there and that random block, um, then just save and quit. Um, oh, funny. Get your bucket server or server. I use bucket. Um, and I've got a normal server. Now just type in percent app data percent like you did for the mod. Um, boom, boom, dot Minecraft. Then instead of going to bin, go to saves, and then find what you called it. I called it YouTube. Then just this is just an easy way. Copy it and paste it to your desktop, and then just add it here. Just move it into that file, and then. What you want to do is go to your server dot properties. I use Notepad plus plus, but it works fine with Notepad. Um, level name, this bit here. Um, you want to type in what you called it. I called it YouTube. You need to get all the capitals right and everything. There you go. And then just save that and get rid of that. And then just run your server. Um, yeah, and then while it's running your server, yada yada da, da, da. Now come up with all this random stuff. And then just open up Minecraft. Log in. Dum -dum -dum. Right now, go on your server. Now it should have the survival map. There you go. That's the map. And then anyone who goes on your server can. Um, do that. Um, I've got a friend here called whatever his name is. 
Um, it, he hasn't got the mod because he's got Mac and Mac's quite hard to install mods, but it still kind of works for him. He still gets the actual map, and um, but he just doesn't get the colours. And yeah, that's basically how you do it. So see ya.